Hi guys, my name is Zilia and you're welcome back to my channel. I am so excited to be doing another episode of your favorite show, That Worry Girl in Lagos. And today's episode is kind of different. It is not me holding a phone to my face like, Hi guys! See you in a bit kind of video. No, I'm not walking on the street. I actually went for this amazing event on the island today and I was like, okay, to be so terrible and bad of me not to share what I actually got. My name is Katira King. I am the former host of CNN African Voices. Um, so the Women International is a self-improvement platform um, and a self-development platform for women. And we do something called The Circle, which is this, every month, um, bi-monthly actually. And it's a support group for women um, to inspire, empower, and motivate women to be the best they can be in every aspect of their lives. No one completes you. You can be yourself with the help of God. They have their role to play, we have our role to play. In every relationship, one of the partners must be able to hold the relationship. That partner must be spiritually, mentally, emotionally more mature than the other partner. But I have to depend on him because men like to feel wanted, right? Yeah. So I have to act like I don't know where to buy a generator <laughs> spare part. I know where to do it. <laughs> Pretty curly. The decision, the choice that you make when you're going to get married, the person you marry. I cannot stand here and give you the entire solution on how to shake off desperation, but what I can tell you is that you need to, and I guess that's what this entire panel is about. At some point, you're going to have to let go of all those things and just step into the person that you're supposed to be for one reason and one reason alone. We were all created in this world to be happy. This is how you meet that guy. That first impression is what he's going to take. So if you want to leave a lasting good impression, you have to come correct the first time. So what is loving on purpose? What is purpose? Is the intention behind why things were created and all that. There are relationships that we were born into that we cannot get rid of, like sister, family, that. But there are other relationships that are by choice, right? So loving on purpose means being intentional with your relationships. For me, what financial independence means to me is that I can I can outsource a lot of things. I can outsource the cooking in my house. I can outsource the laundry. I can outsource many things. But also with wisdom. I know that enough women want to create wealth. To be financially independent and to have freedom to make choices that resonate with everything else we talked about today. That the choice to get up and do what you want when you want to do. Now what should you invest in? Now enough of us do not say that's the most basic thing. One of the things that I always say to people is when you're starting a business, why are you starting a business? The typical 21st century woman is doing more than one thing. And I'm so thankful for you guys for coming out here today. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. And thank you again a thousand times. The closing remarks was given by the host of course, Chini Okoye, and she was amazing. Like, thank you so much for organizing an event like this. So that's it for this video. Thank you for watching, and I hope you enjoyed it. And um, don't forget to follow me on all my social media handles on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. I am Sincerely Zia, and on Snapchat, I am all ABTZ. And don't forget to click the subscribe button. It is totally free. You can click the subscribe button on your phone, you can click it on your PCs, 
or whatever device you're using it is totally free you're not going to be charged and um also click the bell like icon beside the subscribe button it's a notification icon it's going to notify you whenever i post my video and please encourage me like my videos share my videos with your friends i would really appreciate that with that said we've come to the end of the video and i hope to see you next week with another amazing episode of that worry girl in lagos thanks for watching bye